So, Rick, when did you buy the hammer driver? When did you order it? It feels like this is already like a legal interrogation. <laughs> right it's <now>. not. <laughs> um, right. The hammer driver. So I'd seen it online for a number of years. And for some reason, back in the last year, obviously we tried a load of different clubs last year, like the uh, Gold Driver and the Illegal Golf Balls and 750cc Driver, etc. So this kind of hammer driver was always on the kind of wish list, mm-hmm. really. And I thought, they can't still make it because it, I, th- I feel like when I've seen it online, the advert looks so Probably old. Probably 90s, and we'll, early 2000s. We'll come back to the advert in a minute, <laughs> the commercial. And I, I thought, no way they still make it. But weirdly, I started getting more requests about yeah. it on Twitter. We started seeing way more, God, Rick, you've got to test this and like on Facebook. Rick, you've got to test this hammer driver. And I thought, they can't really make it, do they? So anyway, I started searching it. And it was actually really hard to find on Google. It was really yeah, difficult. Like you, if you actually just put in Hammer X Driver, it's really hard to find. Bar it's a lot of forums and stuff quite talking about like it. Negative reviews, yeah. <laughs> negative connotations. Anyway, long story short, I managed to find it. I managed to find the website. Um, I'm actually going to pull the website up right now. Yeah, I think you need to. It's it's among possibly one of the worst websites I've ever seen. So at this point now, this is going out Monday. The video should have gone live, so people have seen the results of it and how it performed. And it wasn't amazing, was it? But it wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. This is what I said to you when we finished filming. In one way, it doesn't hit it 400 yards like it claims, so therefore it's not very good. But for the pro- what did you pay, 120 quid? Uh, so let me just work this out. $160. So I, think, I think on the website it claims that it's, it's worth mm-hmm. $600. Right, okay. Right? Um, but everything's on sale, yeah, as you'd imagine. And right. have the big buttons that say buy. Exactly. I've, I've heard enough. I want to buy one now. And like the world's fastest shaft alone is two hundred and fifty dollars. Well, it would be, wouldn't it? <laughs> to be fair, it's actually got a good grip. Oh it's got God, a super stroke. Ridiculous. I'm back on the website. It's just ridiculous, right? I paid. Long story short, and I don't know whether it's changed at the time of recording of this podcast, but I paid one hundred and sixty-five dollars for so that's what, one hundred and twenty pounds. Which won't See, get you right out of driving now, now. Right now, it's on uh, one hundred and twenty-nine ninety. Wow. Dollars. So I got ripped Don't off. Don't tempt me. <laughs> but you, you have to order it in the next 58 minutes, 22 seconds. Of course you do. Uh, plus you get a free 70% off flat shaft. Free power book. Free 70% off flat shaft. Maybe you get a second shaft. <laughs> to do with what you will. Free power golf ebook. Free worldwide shipping. Free hammer video lesson. By the way, I received none of that for free when I ordered mine. You did receive a really good head cover, though. Yeah, the head cover's class. The head cover's actually good. So, well, I don't go. even know where we start with I this. I think we'll just start with, um, with... So, the inventor of this golf club is called Jack Ham. That's fine. Well, let's just speak of what we say. It's Jack Ham, which is correct. H-A-M-M. And then why don't you just scroll down to his list of achievements that we will just read out off the website. We this won't. is literally off the website. So, Jack Ham is the six-time long drive champion. Okay. And the number one golf club designer in the world. Right. This is on the website. We're not making this up. This is on the website, right? Let let me let me scroll down to the (laughs) about Jack the Hammer Ham. Oh yeah. Okay. Talk to me. First line. The only human alive Mm -hmm. whoa to average four hundred yards off the tee. Dot dot dot. It's hammer time. Of course. Okay. If I used, this is a quote, if I used any other driver, I'd lose 60 yards. Wow. On my very next swing due to outdated technology. Okay. Okay. So let's just say he's hitting with the hammer, right? 400 yards. Yeah. You put a sim, tailor made sim, Correct. max in his hand. Fitted out everything. It's down to 340. 340 straight, 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 away. straight okay. away. Makes okay. sense. So this is his list of achievements. Okay. This is, I cannot stress this enough. I am reading this off the website that you buy this driver from. Okay? <laughs> this, is not, this is not me making any of this up. Here we go. How many achievements has he got, roughly? Because I'm just going to prepare myself. Make sure yeah. everyone's sitting comfortably. 15. Okay, I'm ready. Can we have every one, please? Yes. So, Jack the Hammer Ham. Six-time world long drive champion. Okay. I have Googled that and I can't find any, anything uh, uh, on. Uh, but, 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 okay. It's in evidence. On the website, guy. <laughs> do not question. <laughs> Holds six world records. Okay. Yeah. Again, hard to find, but it's on the website. 
His drives have 11 seconds of hang time. Okay. Let's put that into some perspective. Tour average is probably like eight, nine seconds. Yeah. So 11 yeah, seconds. I mean, long. that's, yeah, yeah. That's a A master's degree in engineering. That could, yeah. That could literally be true. He's the only human that alive to average over 400 yards. We've talked about this. And he is over 50 years old. That's an achievement. He's not the only man alive over 50 years old, though. No, I know he's the only man alive to average 400 yards off the tee, and he's over 50 years old. He created, this is on his website, I cannot stress this enough, he created Grip It and Rip It Okay. when he gave lessons to no other than John Daly. Oh, wow. The John Daly from Open Fame of 1995, right? This is where it gets great. <clears throat> if that's not enough... It can hit an eight iron 260 yards every time. I like the every time. There. Every time. What I like about that is can hit an eight iron 260 yards every time. Like can almost feels like can a, would be can hit it like occasionally yeah. if it's a smoke one, but it's yeah. like it can do it every, every time. time. It's yeah. like if it said he hits his eight iron 260 yards every time. Yeah. But anyway, <laughs> this is great. This uh, this is actually one of my favourites right now. In one round of golf, he drove, it's actually spelled incorrectly, in one round of golf, he grove, and I'm guessing it means drove, unless he's done that for legal reasons, <laughs> eight par fours, wow. he drove eight par fours, and had only 29 golf shots. Okay? Hold okay. on, this doesn't make sense. He had only 29 golf shots, with 43 putts. <laughs> Just for a minute, just work out the maths there. So say again. So he had one round of golf right. where he drove eight par fours yeah. and had only 29 golf shots. So it means the putts he added on. So he's had a lot of putts. With 43 putts. So what's 29 add eight, eight, 43? It's so 74. bad I'm using a calculator for this. No, 78. No, 70. Add 43. 72. 72. That's so he's, he shot level par after driving eight par fours. That's a bad round, isn't it? Um, wow, and it says, wow, if only the hammer could put. Well, if he could put, it'd be like Happy Gilmore. I'm going to whiz through these pretty quickly. On a 358-yard hole, mm-hmm. <laughs> he had to chip back 100 yards because he flew the green by 100 yards. So, let's, no, let's not rush. Let's take our time. He's got to <laughs> Maybe a, I shouldn't laugh. It, he's got it? to a par four that's 358 yards, and yes. the jack the hammer tees it up, right? And he thinks, 358 to the green, okay, driver. He mistakenly hits it 458. <laughs> Correct. And then has to chip back 100 yards. Correct. Oh, God. He's banned from every driving range in what? Ameri- America. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Obvious, isn't it? He loses all the golf balls. Oh, right. Um, he outdrives all the leading pros by over 100 yards. He holds 10 patents, which could be true. You know, I could hold 10 it patents. It all could be true. Given lessons to all of the leading pros and added 50 yards to their shots in 15 minutes. Yeah. So he's, he's coached Rory by that standard. Well, he's actually got a list of who he's coached. Okay. Great. He genuinely wants to help every golfer play better golf. That's and nice. And his greatest satisf- satisf- satisfaction, satisfaction <laughs> is to help others play golf. He has eight course records with a low round of 58. He must be able to put that day. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Here we go. In addition, so that's that's the achievements. That they're bullet pointed. It continues to go on. In addition to holding six Guinness World Long Drive records, right. again, hard to find. <laughs> I personally have helped many of the leading PGA pros as well as many well-known celebrities since 1998. My hammer system has a- accounted for many, for more than 289 wins on the PGA Tour, including right. 41 major championship victories so so jack has has coached 41 major winners i've i've shared my hammer system to many golf professionals well-known celebrities who include okay you ready it's not many big names is it really probably smaller names that I've not heard of. <clears throat> i feel i'm well i'm going to start in reverse order then so start small go big okay sylvester sloan yeah that's you, the smallest that's name small. on this list okay <laughs> sean connery yeah john elway michael jordan okay okay the michael jordan Unless these are just people who have the same name. I feel like you could you could get away with teaching someone who's called Sean Connery who's not Sean Connery. Or Michael Jordan. Or John Elway who's not El- yeah. John or Michael Jordan or Danny Edwards. It's gonna be hard to find another Sylvester Stallone, I imagine. I would agree. <laughs> um uh, let's see about Steve Jones, one major. Never never heard of him. 
uh, Don Co Jones, one major. Freddie Couples. Oh, nice. Here we go. Now we're getting to the I golfers. I feel like Freddie Couples doesn't strike me as a guy that would really grip it and rip it. No. Freddie Couples, With the hammer system. five majors. John Daly, three majors. Sergio Garcia, one major. So this is an updated website. Oh, so before he won the Masters, he got in touch with John. John gave a few tips, and he won at Augusta. Or Jack. Jack, yeah, that's it, Jack. Greg Norman, three majors. Greg's won more than three, has he not? Oh, I don't know my knowledge on this. Phil if Mich- it's on this sheet, I'm saying it's gospel. Okay. Phil Mickelson, five majors. You ready? Yeah. Last two. Can you guess the last two? Obviously, he's not coached Tiger Woods. So I'm not going to I'm not gonna say Tiger Woods because... Well, that guy is where you're actually mistaken. So it wasn't Butch Harmon. It wasn't Sean Foley. Or <laughs> Frank Haney or anyone. No. Yeah. Uh, Tiger Woods is on this list as the oh, number okay. one name. And then after that is Arnold Palmer. I've got a question. All oh, right. Okay, Arnie. Stand it. <laughs> I've got a question for you then. Is it down as Tiger 14 or 15 majors? 14. Oh, so we didn't get involved with the Masters recently. No, That's no, fine. No. That makes um, it. Okay. There's a few testimonials. Uh, are these just random people on Facebook? Or are these yeah, yeah. Or these are just like common people. Yeah. Like not, not high range celebrities. Uh, oh, Rick Beanie. Let me just read this. Let me just proofread this before I read it. Unless drops in. Oh, they're not that great, actually. They're quite boring. I don't think I need any more mm. evidence, to be honest. I've owned one for two years and love it. Anyway. Um, oh, my. It's ridiculous. This <laughs> so, <laughs> long story short, um, I ordered this driver in, in October uh, for one reason or another. And I don't mind saying, you know, apparently got held up in customs. Uh, it didn't get over here to the UK. Apparently, he's never actually shipped one here to the UK. And the reason I know that is because I made the mistake of when I ordered it, I used my real name. Mm. And unfortunately, I used my real phone number. Yeah. So you had a few calls. Since October, I've had many phone calls, many emails, many voicemails from no other. I, sh- I mean, I sh- really, we need to get him in for a podcast. No other than Jack the Hammer Ham himself. He has my number. I have it saved in my phone. I should now be on this list, potentially. You should now be out driving me. I feel like maybe I don't quite sit above Sylvester Stallone. So, I, you know, on that list on the website... You wouldn't sit above him, but you'd be on that list, I'd I say. I think so. I should be on that list. I, I think, think you'd be below... I've got, the f- I've got a blue tick on TikTok. Yeah, so you're not the Facebook list. You're like a celebrity list, but you're quite low down on the rank. Potentially. Correct. But who knows? So... I'm not sure what the repercussions are going to be after the review. I reviewed it, We've and, I, and I'll be honest, I didn't mention any of this in, re- in the review because at the end of the day, the, the YouTube video that we did, we reviewed the product. Yeah. The product claimed to be the world's longest driver. Yeah. The product... Um, what did I just say? The product, the product claims to be the world's claimed, longest driver. <laughs> claimed to be the world's... Fa- the, have the world's fastest shaft. And the product proved... Uh, why do I keep getting that? The product claimed to, to help me hit the ball 400 yards. Yeah. If you've watched the video, you'll know that maybe it's not the case. The only thing is, since you've been having these phone calls with, with Jack the Ham, I feel like you've started talking a little bit more American. <laughs> like when you were in for you, howdy guy. I was like, what? I said, hey guy, I'm going to help you hit the ball 400 yards today. Um, since many phone calls from Jack and voicemails and listening to Jack, I think I had one phone call where I listened to him for 10 minutes. Yeah. Uh, While well, I was actually on a treadmill, I actually ran. I know, no big deal. <laughs> and people probably think that's the biggest lie of this whole podcast <laughs> yeah. that I was on a treadmill. <laughs> I believe that Jack hits it 420 <laughs> yards more than you on a treadmill. Truth be told. I was on a treadmill. He rang me at like nine o'clock at night. I'd nipped to the gym and literally spoke for 10 minutes. And, and I, I unmuted it and came off the phone, gasping a breath. And he went, Oh, you're right, Rick. I went, Yeah, I've just been on the treadmill. He hadn't realized because he mm. spoke that long. He also reckons he's got a system that, that will. Guaranteed to make me hit the ball 50 yards longer. I'll be honest. Yeah. I can't hit the ball 50 yards longer. I can't. No. I carry it just under 290 on GC quad, 310 total distance, whatever. I cannot hit it 50 yards. For, I can't carry it 340. So, long story short, I don't even know what the story is. It was basically just a, a nice story about the website. A bit more, um, as I said, hope, hopefully people have watched the video so they know what we're talking about. Hope there's... We're saying all this now, there could be a problem with the edit. It might never go out. It won't be. But no, unless he sues us. Yeah. But I feel like we've got enough it'd be quite good. <laughs> it'd be quite good if you have to do an apology video in his corner. <laughs> and then I, I reckon, it, the only, I'll tell you what, I'll do an apology video. Yeah. If he gets Tiger Woods, Arnie. No. Sylvester Stallone. <laughs> Maybe not Arnie. Tiger Woods. Tiger and Sergio will be enough to If there's some evidence, or if I can get Tiger and Sergio on a phone call, 
that ring me up and say and vouch mm-hmm. for Jack the Hammer. Or that's true. Or just get one driving range from the USA to call us and, and just tell us that he is he's yeah. banned. Or if he's if that's the case, if if that if th- if that happens, I'll happily apologize and do an apology video on the main channel on the main channel okay if if literally i think one driving range is a bit too little number. 10 driving ranges yeah, t- i think 10 driving ranges i want a, a personalized video message from tiger i mean if if jack has helped tiger win 14 majors it's the least tiger can do to so just give you a call correct even like an audio message on email. Yeah. If somebody else's email, it's hey, it's Eldrick. I here. know, but I feel even that like Con- Connor sketches could fake that. I feel I want to see a Twitter DM. Correct. Verified do. Twitter DM saying this is Tiger. Hey Rick, this is Tiger. It's Let- true about Jack. Correct. Lay off Jack. He's, He's a, a real guy. deal. Yeah. I wish I could hit it as far as him. If I did, I'd have probably won twenty or fifty majors, majors by yeah. now. If Jack could have putted, we wouldn't have been talking about Tiger Woods right now. He'd be Jack the Hammer. Correct. Right? 